Hello everyone, this is Nikki with American Bollywood TV and today we're going to introduce you to the CEO of the Skycast Group, Mr. Victor Abraham. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us today, Mr. Abraham. Thank you, Nikki. It's a joy to be on your show. Heard a lot about uh, you and, and the team and all that y'all are doing to really bring the community together. So definitely it's an honor to be here. And um, speaking of bringing the community together, you're actually sponsoring yeah. um, one of the shows on May 20th yes. for Han Akhtar and band. Yes. So, um, do you like Bollywood? Do you like the whole music? Oh, no, I don't even know about Bollywood. No, I'm just kidding. Bollywood is there <laughs> in my blood, in my bloodstream to an extent because uh, it's been an amazing journey as I look back. Uh, I myself have done a, a, a big Bollywood show here. I don't know if you remember when we... In uh, 2010, we brought A.R. Rahman and his whole team here, the Jai Ho yeah. show. So I was there too. You were there too. Yeah. So did you like the show? Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah, one of a kind, right? It was. Yeah. So I'm sure Farhan Akhtar also will do a fantastic job because uh, I say when words fail, music speaks. Yeah. When words fail, music speaks. And I think that's what uh, Farhan probably will... Uh, sing to our soul and uh, I'm sure it will entertain all of us. Looking forward for the Farhan Akhtar show. So, so it seems like music has had a big impact on your life. You talk about music so beautifully. So um, can you tell us more about how music has had an impact on your life in any way? Wow. Uh, music is the answer to uh, to a lot of questions that we have in our mind. Uh, you know, I always say the ability to speak many languages yeah. is an asset, but the ability to sing in many languages is priceless. Yeah. So music can definitely warm your heart and your soul and, and uh, somebody like Farhan can come and really warm uh, the community's heart and we're looking forward for this fantastic show that is ahead of us. Yes. So. And um, there's been a lot of shows actually going on in the Dallas area because the Indian community is growing so rapidly. And um, what do you think about all these shows happening and bringing the community together? Well, definitely good shows are welcome in the city and I think there is enough people to go and enjoy and enough time in our hands. And uh, the people of Dallas love entertainment and to entertain people. So we have, you know, all kinds of show that comes in. We can definitely pick and choose the show we want to go and we have a variety of shows that uh, is out there. So definitely uh, it's entertainment yeah. and that's a part of everybody looks for a weekend and they want to either go to the movies or they want to get some kind of entertainment, go with family and friends and have fun. Yeah, it's a good family. Yeah. Show. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So yeah, so it is definitely a joy actually, let me put it that way. And the more shows that we get into this town is welcome and uh, I think uh, our community will definitely enjoy it and look forward for it. You know, yeah, so. and thanks to you since you are sponsoring it. It is a joy, it is a privilege to sponsor it's the Farhan Akhtar show. I know him personally also. In fact, uh, Farhan uh, was, uh, you know, I was looking to get him, you know, I'm producing a movie which will be released this summer. And Farhan was one, supposed to be one of the actors in there. <laughs> but because of his time constraints, he couldn't be on that. Mm -hmm. And we ended up uh, taking another actor for the movie. So. Wow, a so, lot of, so you are really interested in Bollywood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Bollywood is there. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Because that is something that everybody likes. And uh, we've all grown up watching movies and watching actors and okay. songs. And, you know, you're not... Reciting the dialogue. Absolutely. What can you tell us about your company and how you started this company, which is such a massive success now? Well, I don't know about that. I would like to think like that, you know, that, that's what I tell everybody. I do a little bit of everything and a whole lot of nothing. But by the grace of God, I do it well. Yes. So my journey goes back to close to 26 years ago when I started uh, Skypass. We started it as a travel company, basically just with nothing in my pocket and it was a banker who helped me really come out of that and who invested in my dreams and my aspirations to grow and do well and one thing led to the other and uh, travel we started 
and along with travel then came entertainment um, like i mentioned uh, we did the uh, the world tour for ar rahman and his whole whole team so that is what the entertainment stint was all about and then uh, it led to hospitality and hospitality we you know we have a couple of hotels here Uh, which complements our travel as well as entertainment and uh, so that is the hospitality side of it and then as i go back in my journey it was a banker who helped me so we launched a bank here oh, wow. in <laughs> south lake and uh, we have opened up a bran- uh, branch in fort worth so i'm a banker also uh, along with that <laughs> So all that put together this group uh, you know and recently we started the Expedia cruise ship center and I hope you'll get a chance to take a a picture of the exterior and the interior accordingly so I'll give you a little tour after this but uh um the cruise ship center is basically we tied up with Expedia to start one of its kind here in Dallas because we have the buying power of Expedia to really buy cruises at very good deals and be able to give that to the community so that is something that we are promoting right now it's just a uh, it's been just a few months that we have started it and that is what we are getting it out the word into the community so if you or your family is going on a cruise just call us the Expedia <laughs> Cruise Center in Dallas part of the Skypass group and uh, so that's how we have grown so we have done very well by you know um uh, I I always say with God all things are possible and that is you know first God family and friends and families who support you know and that's how we have um you know we have grown this past 25 years done very well that's all I can say All right and okay. how many locations do you have is this the only location No we have one in Austin one in Houston and then back uh, back in India we have it in Mumbai and in Bangalore and uh, we are now opening up a branch in Canada and Mexico also so everywhere so, uh, i don't know about everywhere but so, one day at a time that's all you know so but we have been blessed that's all i can say so mr abraham when you started you had yeah. someone to sort of help you out and help you grow as a venture capitalist um so when you see someone else with the same enthusiasm and same passion mm-hmm. as you have yeah. um how do you support it and how do you encourage it Well a quote comes to mind and I was just sharing that with you it does not take light away from your candle to light another candle and that's some of the principles that we practice here in our organization and that's what keeps us going because like you said it was somebody else who lifted me up when I was low and today I am because of that and that is what we need to pass pass it on to you know generations to come that is the only way because that is what i believe you become successful by helping just enough others also to be successful and that's what that's that's what keeps us going and you know basically uh my door is always open uh you know i try and mentor our young generation so that they can do well out there because i know when i started out it was not easy for me and uh and like i like i just mentioned earlier it you know it takes uh encouragement it takes motivation and inspiration to really get going and that's all we can do that's all we you know you just take it and live it one day at a time and life uh, your dreams can come true let me put it that way and it sort of seems like that's the model of your group as well sort of helping the community getting yeah. them good deals and helping them travel absolutely them absolutely them yeah yeah when they travel we have that peace of mind and make sure and ensure that you know uh if we send somebody on a flight we want to make sure right from the origin to destination that their travel is taken care of they don't have to worry and they can trust uh a group like us right. so that's where you know that's why even our logo says your passage is our priority so you know where we want to make sure that is our priority in all that we do so okay. and what advice do you have to young entrepreneurs who are watching you or who hope to become like you someday well take it one day at a time dream dare and dive basically if you you know dream and dare to do what you want you'll definitely you know uh, i mean you just have to think and you have to act upon it 
I know it's not easy, I mean it's easily said, but if there is a will, there is a way. We all know that, so put your heart to it, put your mind to it and uh, go for it. That's, that's what I would, uh, I would advise. All right, folks, so that wraps up our interview with the CEO of the SkyPass Group, Mr. Victor Abraham. Thank yeah. you so much for being on the show. Thank you, Nikki, for giving us the opportunity, giving me the opportunity, and thank you, American Bollywood TV, for this privilege, and definitely wish you all all the best. And God we'll bless. see you at the Farah Nakhtar Club. Yes, all right, live. <laughs> <laughs> we will. All right, everyone, this is Nikki with American Bollywood TV.